Hi, Brent Tech here with Tech is Made Simple. In this video, I will show you how to change some settings in Pop! OS and Linux Ubuntu using the GNOME Tweaks package. Now, GNOME Tweaks is a package that you can download and install that changes settings in Pop! OS and Ubuntu that will just help your workflow run a lot smoother and just add a little bit more functionality to your user experience. Now, Pop! OS is basically a newer, shinier version of Linux Ubuntu. And Pop! OS and Ubuntu are, bo are both based on the GNOME shell desktop experience. I will be using Pop! OS today, but you can follow along with Ubuntu because the two are very similar in their workflow and their layout on your desktop. And as I say, what I do in Pop! OS, you will be able to do in Linux Ubuntu. Now, to get to GNOME Tweaks, uh, in Pop! OS, go to your Pop! Shop and in Ubuntu, navigate to your application store. If they are not in your dock, just go to your Show Applications and you just go to Pop! Shop. And then on your home page, you just type in, in the search, you just type in GNOME Tweaks. And you can see it's just put it at the top. You just click on GNOME Tweaks. Now I've installed my GNOME Tweaks already. So all you do is you'll be an install tab. You just click on that and install the package. Let's just minimize that. Now once it's installed, you go to your show applications. If it's not in the default view, then it'll either be in system or Utilities, I've put mine in Utilities, and you just click on Tweaks. Give that a second to open up. And now we are in the GNOME Tweaks package. Now, I found this a very useful little package, and I don't know why it is not added to Ubuntu and Pop! OS or any GNOME version of Linux by default, as I found it a very handy little feature to use. Now, the first... Um, section we're going to look at is general and we are going to disable animations now I like to do that because I don't like animations when I open and close you know different programs and menus and I like things just to be snappy and when you um, disable animations it just makes the whole user experience feel a lot more snappier and user friendly and then the next one we're going to go to as I say there's a lot of other tabs here in the menu you can explore but I'm just showing you today the ones that I changed to make my user experience a lot better and um, startup applications is a good one where you can you know you go to startup applications you just click on the add tab and yeah you can add an applications to, to start when you start up your operating system so for example if I want files to start and open up when I start up my pop OS I just click on files and I click on add and that will um, start up the next time I start up my operating system. So that is quite a handy feature to have. And then the top bar, yeah, I change a few settings. Now you can see by default, my battery icon has no percentage and I find that's a little bit hard to see. So what I like to do is I go to battery percentage and you can see now I've got the percentage of my battery running. And because I'm running from a laptop and that just makes things a lot more user friendly. Another thing is on the calendar, I like to add a weekday. Now you can see there's Tuesday added to February the 2nd. Now you can even add seconds to your clock if you want to, but I find that a bit distracting. And then calendar, add week numbers to calendar. So if I click on that and I go to my calendar, you can see I now have uh, the week numbers of the year added to my calendar, which I find is a very handy feature. And then Windows title bars is the next one we're going to look at. Now, you can see in Pop! OS that there are no minimize and maximize buttons in the top right. Now, this feature is there in Ubuntu, but not in Pop! OS. So if I want to minimize a window, I have to right click and then go minimize in Pop! OS and then if I want to maximize, I've got to right click and go maximize 
And I just found this a bit tedious. You know, it's just extra steps that, you know, you have to do to get the same result. So, yeah, you have title bar buttons. And in Popo S, you can just add the maximize and you can add the minimize. And that just makes things a lot more user friendly. I find that with those buttons there. Now, you know, some people might not like that, but I find it very useful indeed. And in Ubuntu, as I say, this won't apply to Ubuntu this tweak because these buttons are already in the title bar in Ubuntu. And then I don't think there's anything under, no, there's nothing under there. You can just, you know, go to the other menu uh, tweaks if you want to and just explore there for yourself. But those are what I add to my Pop! OS and Ubuntu. Just to recap, I like to disable animations. Startup applications, you can add an application to start up and by default when you start your operating system. My top bar, I add the battery percentage, the weekday and the week numbers to my calendar. And title bars with Pop! OS, I like to add the minimize and the maximize button to my title bar. So that is how I use GNOME tweaks in my Pop! OS and Linux Ubuntu distros just to help my workflow run a lot more smoother and give it a better functionality and user experience. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.